Looking for a way to land yourself job in the cybersecurity? I will try to break down for you what you need to know in order to get hired. Keep in mind that this video is mainly for the beginners that are trying to get first job in the space. Starting from what cybersecurity analyst is doing. You will be monitoring company networks for threats and breaches and any unusual behavior. You will be in charge of updating or informing customers about updates on the software and hardware including less common stuff like switches and routers. Testing system for vulnerabilities using various tools like Nessus and Windows Secure Score. You will be running phishing or other training type campaigns for end users to promote best practices. And now to the boring stuff. You will be conducting risk assessments for the companies and create policies together with the incident reports. So what qualifications do you need? If you're a beginner, I would highly recommend to get yourself a Network Plus exam to familiarize with the network concepts. Remember, you need to know all the basics before jumping in a more advanced concept. The next step will be to pass Security Plus, that will give you a great understanding of security concepts. After passing this, you can start looking for a soft job. The total cost of these two exams is around $700. If you are planning to advance your career and have some experience in the security field, it may be worth to pass Cybersecurity Analysis Plus exam for $400 as it is designed for more advanced users. What are other things than qualifications you may want? Get yourself hand dirty by doing hack-the-box challenges. You can test your own system with Nessus and remediate any vulnerabilities you may find. You can work out user training like phishing campaigns through known before. Also, grow your network on LinkedIn. It's an amazing platform to find security consultants and people that may be looking for someone to work. Don't be afraid to reach out directly to the companies, who knows? Maybe they are looking for someone like you, or they are offering an apprenticeship program. Keep in mind that your experience is way more important than any certificates you may get. Hopefully this video was helpful for you, and you have no clear path of how to get yourself a job in cybersecurity. If you have any questions, please write them down in the comment section. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Good luck, and i see you in the next one.